everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is Donna from Hair Today Gone Tomorrow. Um, today I'm reviewing a wig that I purchased with my own money from samsbeauty.com. This wig is uh, from, I'm not really sure who the maker is, I don't have my stock card, but this is the Carrie wig. Um, this is an extremely popular unit. Um, everybody seems like they have a video on Facebook and or YouTube about the Carrie wig. This is an A-line wig. She's curly in the back. Um, she does not shed a lot. Um, she's very curly. This is everybody's favorite wig on me at work. Uh, she's probably my least favorite. I guess I'm just used to really, um, I don't know, I'm playing with my hair. Sorry, everybody. Um, I'm just used to really, really um, straight wigs on me. I am not used to, um, Curly wigs or wigs that are a little bit poofy or big. Um, the I'm, I'm not really into um, bit hair that's too big. This is um, this was a very big head friendly cap. I had to customize this cap. It was so large on my head that I had the major hump action back here going on, and I had to actually sew five wefts together to make this wig more customized to the shape of my head and the size of my head. I have a very small head, uh, 21 and a half circumference. So I order almost all of my units in a smaller average size. And if they are too big head friendly, um, I have to customize those and sew some wefts together and to make those smaller so they're a really good fit. Um, I have customized this unit. It is a black brown unit. Um, this unit, uh, I did cut bangs into it. Uh, as you all know, I am a bang lover. I love uh, wigs with bangs, and if they don't have bangs, um, I tend to buy whatever I want and customize them myself. I've always been one that um, I like to play around with my hair and, and just, or my wigs, I should say, I don't have hair, and just, you know, make them my own, give them my own personality. Um, I really felt like the transition uh, with shaving my head, my hair off, what little bit I had left from alopecia would be a real um, difficult, traumatizing experience. But what I have found is it has been so much fun um, finding these wigs, finding what works for me. Of course, it's 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 a process because I'm not sponsored. Um, I, I haven't been sent any wigs. I wish that companies would send me wigs because I'm a new YouTuber. Um, I don't have um, a lot of subscribers. And um, we're the ones out here that um, I would really like to have some wigs to review because I don't have hair. I'm completely bald. And I would like to see other things that are maybe a little bit more expensive that I could afford to read, you know, to re do reviews on and give people my um, honest opinions of things. Um, but this unit was about $32.99. Um, I got this Carrie wig whenever she was, I think, in her height of popularity. Um, I did do a little, like I said, I did the bangs, and I did do a little bit of trimming. She was a little bit too oof for me. So, anyway, this is the Carrie wig. This is my wig review. I love her. She is a pretty wig. Uh, she's a little bit too curly for me, but I wear her to work pretty much probably over half the time. Um, I just don't um, like to wear wigs that are too big to work. Uh, they get really hot and they get really matted. And uh, something like this that's an A-line cut that's going to stay off the back of the neck and it's not going to mat back there is really the way to go if you're a working gal. I will say that I pretty much, I don't, any wigs that I have purchased, and I have purchased a lot of wigs, I just haven't reviewed a lot because pretty much all the wigs that I've used are in the trash now because they're worn out. But um, I like to wear a unit that does not hit um, the back of my neck and or hang down on the shoulders because I'm moving around all the time at work and they get really, really, really uncomfortable and they get really hot. And any long wig, I don't care who you are, uh, how long you're wearing it, they're going to get tangled in the back. They're going to get matted in the back. And that's what destroys the wig. Now, I have boiled wigs. I have used fabric softener on wigs. 
And I have, you know, flat iron wigs and done all of those customizations that help save the life of the wigs. And that does work. Um, but long story short, take care of your wigs. Short wigs are greater for work. Um, and if you have any questions about this wigs or wig or comments about um, this unit, where I purchased it from, like I said, I buy almost all of my wigs from samsbeauty.com. They're very easy to deal with, and I love the fact that they have $4.99 shipping on purchases over $40. Um, I've never had any issue with them. I've never had any problem uh, with anybody in their customer service department or anything like that. So I highly recommend Sam's Beauty. They have great selection and great prices. Uh, again, this is Donna from Hair Today Gone Tomorrow. Please subscribe to my channel. Uh, like this video. If you have any comments, please put them down below. Uh, and the camera fell over. What do you know? So anyway, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, like this video. Everybody have a blessed weekend. Uh, leave your comments down below, and I'll see you next time. Thanks again. Be blessed.